Hey YouTube, how's it going? So today I am doing another Valentine's look because it's 14 days of Valentine's, but we are using only Shop Miss A products. If you don't know what Shop Miss A is, girl, go see the website. I will link it below. Everything there is so affordable, more affordable than drugstore. Really good quality because I've tested so many of their products. Uh, and I'm talking about things are a dollar. The foundations, a dollar. The concealers, a dollar. The eyeshadows are a dollar. The setting sprays, a dollar. Like you need to go check it out right now. I decided to put Shop Miss A to the test to create a beautiful Valentine's look. And everything on my face is from Shop Miss A. And it's all super cheap, like a dollar. Like the cheapest of the cheapest, talking price wise. And I love how it turned out. I hope you do too. I hope this makes you excited. Like I look expensive, but I'm not. I look pricey, but I'm not. I look blanging, but it's cheap. I hope you really like this video. If you're new, hi, welcome, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you're notified of all my future videos. Don't forget to go follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. Yep, I am on the talk. I am on the talk. Go follow me over there. And uh, yeah, let's just get started with this makeup. Uh, so I got these super cute headbands from Shop Miss A. I wanted to show you uh, because I think they're super, super cute. Look at this. Really? Like, look at this. So cute. They also have like these hair tie, bow hair ties. So perfect for Valentine's. They're velvet. They're really good material. So I thought this was so cute. So I'm going to go with this one because it's super cute. And we're going to put my hair up so we can get started. You guys need to go check out their site. Like they have like bubble bars and like all types of things. Okay. Cute, we're starting off on a good note. All right, brows. They have a micro brow pencil now. Let me open this baby up. Gosh, I hate opening stuff. So I have the AOA Studio Slim Brow Pencil. Like I told you guys in the intro, we're doing it all Shop Miss A, and I'm sticking to mostly all the AOA brand from Shop Miss A, which is Shop Miss A's, Miss A's actual brand. So uh, I have the AOA Slim Brow Pencil in the shade Caramel. So let's see. I even have my AOA Studio uh, mirror here. So let's see how this... Oh, Caramel is, I should have known, but caramel's orangey. It's an orangey color. Now the formula of this brush is nice. Of this uh, eyebrow pencil is nice. Very, very nice. Like I should have bought a couple of options because this one, this one's too brown. So, I mean, this one's too orangey. So I'm just gonna put in a couple of, but the formula is bomb. I like it. I like the formula. And we're gonna deal with it because my hair is blonde and it has some gold in it. So I think I can pull this off. And it has a nice little brush on the end. So this is nice, it's not bad at all. I definitely would go back. Oh my gosh, for a dollar, I would definitely like buy a ton of these. This is actually a really good formula and the cheapest. Let's go in with eyes. I am going to use just some of the AOA liquid concealer to prep my eyes for eyeshadow. I got these baked eyeshadows from AOA and I'm really excited because first off, they're huge. I thought they were gonna be smaller. They're, they look like blushes. They're so big. So that's a lot of product for a good price. So I'll show you the baked eyeshadows I got. I got the, okay, so these are the AOA Wander baked eyeshadows. So we have this beautiful like red color. This is really, really, really cool. Really beautiful. 
Then we have this one called Goblin, which is a black, like a gunmetal, almost black, really pretty. We're probably gonna use that to do something smoky. Then this one, oh, this is a beautiful peachy metallic. And then this one is called Creamsicle. Oh my gosh, this is what I would put like all over the lid for like a very subtle, but easy wearable like look. I just put this like all. First, the color Nude from Amuse, and I'm gonna put that into the crease and up above. And I'm going to use an AOA studio brush. Their sets, brush sets are so great. So I'm doing that. And these eyeshadows are really nice. The only ones I haven't tested are the baked shadows because those are new to me. So I'm gonna get into, now I have like this darker color. It's a, still a brown, but it's a little bit darker called cinnamon. I'm gonna get into that matte shade and I'm going to go in the crease. Okay, so I'm gonna go into the AOA Studio Butter Cream and Ganache. It's like a black with a little bit of like a sheen to it. It is a cream shadow, so I'm gonna get into it with a brush and I'm gonna really smudge it out close to my lashes. Now I'm gonna put this color, this is like oh, literally a creamsicle. I love it so much. I'm putting this all over the lid, all over, just beautiful with a wet brush. Sometimes baked eyeshadows have like almost like a coat on top to kind of keep them together. So I had to go back in. Ooh, this is pretty. It's okay if I go over that black. Ooh, yes, this is giving me really soft, wearable Valentine's vibes. I like looks like this because they're so real. Like we, honestly, if you're anything like me, you just don't have time to spend a ton of time on your makeup. Sometimes you just want to just get nice and go like quickly. And so these type of looks and these type of shadows are just nice because they're so easy to do that with. So I'm gonna get into that brown from before and use that to like blend the edges that like deeper brown. I, I love this, so wearable. No one can tell me that they can't do a look like this, wear a look like this. I'm gonna get into this black shade now and I'm going to now smoke it out really close to the lashes. So this is like a black slash, more, probably more like a gunmetal-y shade. I'm not wetting my brush or anything, but I'm just gonna start to smoke it. So I'm applying it with like a dense brush. I'm gonna get in with another brush so it doesn't have anything on it and I'm gonna try to smoke it. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty. And then I'm just gonna get, this is the AOA Studio, like a angled liner brush. I'm gonna get back into that shade and just get really close to the lashes. Ooh, I like this. This is very simple, but beautiful. All right, uh, let's pop on some lashes, shall we? These are the lashes I got. These are 3D faux mink lashes. We're gonna go dramatic with the lashes here. These are AOA, they're 155, very affordable in the style Harper. Look at this, like just so beautiful. And I love, and I've mentioned this before, the AOA Super Strip Lash Adhesive. I love the black one. It only takes, you only need to wait for like 30 seconds, or honestly, I count to three. I go one, two, three, and then I start to put them on because this dries very, very, very quickly. You don't want to wait for it to dry too much. But I have now the Super Strip Lash Adhesive in Clear. This is new to me. I've been testing it out and I've been liking it. It's good. So I'm gonna put that on with these lashes. 
Obviously, if you want to do like a simple look, you can go with simpler lashes, but these are the only AOA Studio lashes that I was able to get my hands on because they're so popular, they're always sold out. I love them. They're very beautiful and very dramatic. I'm actually really in love with these. These are gorgeous. Putting on some foundation. I have a new primer from them, the AOA Clean Slate Primer. I do like their powder primers. I do like their foundations, um, but I haven't tried this one. So let's try this out. Whoa. These just have a really clean scent to them. Whoa. This one's a lot thicker than I thought it was going to be. It says it's lightweight and melts right into your skin, leaving it silky smooth while extending makeup wear. This is nice. I actually love their AOA Aqua Hydrating Foundation, but this one feels like it's more hydrating than the Aqua one. So it's nice. Just smells very clean. I actually like how this one feels. It feels really nice, gave me a a light tacky finish. Okay, I have two foundations here, the AOA Buildable Satin Foundation. This is a really good foundation. And then I also have the Pro Wear Full Coverage Foundation. Again, really nice foundation. I think I'm gonna do the Buildable Satin Coverage. I have the shade Pure Beige. I'm gonna put this baby on. on this one just looks so nice like it leaves my skin looking so good okay for concealer i again have the aoa studio light concealer i have two shades buff and nude i think i'm going to use nude to conceal this little guy here So I'm putting this one. This one is a shade buff. So I just kind of set like the T-zone and underneath my nose because I'm gonna use this AOA Pro Wear foundation in the shade Cappuccino to contour and bronze. So I'm putting a little bit of that on the back of my hand. I'm going to use that. The blush that I got is a cream blush. This is the AOA cream blush in the shade Hush. It's like a peachy shade, which I think would be perfect for a look like this. So I'm going to get into this here. This is the high definition oh sorry this is the high definition brush it's the 106 it's a stippling brush so i'm going to try to use this and see how that works for this cream brush blush blush <laughs> this is nice this is actually would be a perfect like cream highlight brush so maybe I'll clean this off real quick so that I can use it for the cream highlight that I have yeah I'm gonna do that I'm gonna clean that off and I have this high definition brush again a dual fiber brush I'm gonna use this for my blush instead oh yeah so this is the AOA F6 this is really nice actually and I have this highlight here called Dewy. So it looks like this, and I hope it's not a duochrome, but it's pretty. So I thought I would put this on and then we could put on the other powder highlight on top to kind of set it. But let's try this like gold. Whoa. Wow, this brush is amazing for cream highlights. 
Wow, guys, you need this brush. This is the E106. Oh, this is perfect. Wow, I actually really like that. Wow, that's really pretty just on its own. Okay, but I have this Velour Highlight from AOA. What the heck? <gasps> this is like one of those like cushiony like highlights. It's not a powder. Oh, okay, we're putting that on. We're putting that on. Oh, it's like a cloud highlight. It's like interesting. Oh my gosh, no way. No way. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my gosh. That's it. I'm getting back on there and I'm going to buy all of the Velour products because this is so nice, feels nice, blends in nice with my finger. I usually can't just like tap a highlight on, like a cream highlight like this, and it just like blends in and looks beautiful. I, ca I can never do that. It's, it's, it's impossible. This consistency, it's like a cushion highlight. Very pretty. I think I'm gonna put this Amuse eyeshadow in nude and then underneath my eyes, and then I'm gonna go in with this creamsicle shade. So that's what I'm gonna put underneath my eyes. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. That is amazing. I'm gonna put this velour highlight in the inner, in my inner corners. Cause it's so, oh my gosh, I can't even explain it. It's pretty. I think I'm gonna do like a blue in the eyeliner. To make it kind of fun so i did just blue eyeliner okay let's move on to the, oh let's use this setting spray so this is the aoa a plus setting spray it's supposed to lock in your makeup again from shop miss a so good all right it smells like fresh roses but the spray actually isn't bad like they're not humongous drops i mean they're bigger drops but the spray's not bad. I actually really like this. This is, I mean, we'll see how it works. For lips, I got a nude lipstick. I love their AOA. I love their AOA matte liquid lipsticks. Those are really good. They last all day. Uh, I also tried out these last time. I, I bought from their store, just the regular AOA lipsticks, and I like them. I got a bunch of red ones, so I wanted to try a nude one. This one's in the shade Shore. And then I have like this pink diamond lip gloss, it's called, in Girl Power. It's like it has a duo chrome to it. So I think I'm gonna put this on since my eyes are so like soft and natural. I can go a little bit crazy with the gloss. This is the shade Shore. Mmm, this one's nice. I like this shade really pretty the formula is really creamy has like a satin maybe a matte this alone is a beautiful lip like makeup look from shop miss a but let's put on some of this diamond lip gloss yeah so it has like almost like a purpley the pinky purpley duochrome Ooh, I like it. This look is very unique, very beautiful, very different than any of the other looks, but soft and wearable and just like, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling this look, you guys. It feels like super thin formula. Super thin and just very nice. I like it. This look though is so cute, you guys. I love how I look. I can't believe this is all Shop Miss A. I'm gonna give Shop Miss A a thumbs up. They have past the challenge with flying colors of being able to create a beautiful Valentine's look for such an affordable price. I will link their website down below. I'll also link everything that I used down below. Uh, I hope you really enjoyed the video. 
I hope you like my look. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. So what do you guys think about my look? I love and I can't believe. Can you believe that this is all using $1 products or $2 products? Like, can you believe that? Does, does that look like a $1, $2 makeup look? Let me know down below. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe and go follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. Make sure to come back tomorrow for another video. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.